is going on guys welcome back to another video my name is Ron and this is MotorTube if you're stopping by for the first time smash that subscribe button turn your notification bell on to stay up to date with my videos and be part of the family make sure you check out my website it's the first link in the description got my merch there and all that good stuff so today we are about to do a few things so I have big news coming up for you guys I know I've been holding it off for so long um, I'm gonna keep it secret, so I've been keeping this for a little while from you guys. It's all gonna make sense. Today is a little bit a part of what that has to do. So I'm gonna stop by a, a friend of mine, Sean's garage. He has a, he has a lot of cars, so we're gonna check that out first. We all we're also gonna pick up some wheels and tires for the Hellcat. Yes, we're gonna uh, put a different set on it because, uh, like I said, it'll all make sense and on why I'm doing everything. So just stay tuned for that. So enough of me talking. Let's turn on the Mustang and get going. Uh, we're not gonna take we're not gonna take the Mustang to go get the wheels just because it's not gonna fit. But we're gonna take it. Um, I'm gonna go and get something for um, Mike, uh, my friend. Uh, so we're just gonna take the Mustang now. And that's what we're gonna do. Then we're gonna come back, swap it, get the SUV, and go get the. Uh, wheels and tires, so let's get it. Whoop! Two hours later. Now we're gonna put the Mustang back in the garage. The traffic is just crazy. The highway is down to two lanes. I don't even know what that lane is even being used for. There's just cones. Not much work being done, but there's still cones and then there's traffic. All right, guys, so we're here. This is the Hellcat. Sitting on some 305 and Bravados, 18s, by the way. There's a Camaro right here. There's a vet. More cars here. He's doing, uh, this thing is kind of like the Taser where it just it does a little light show, but that's that right here. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, that's sick. So these are gonna go on that vet that's outside. How wide are these? Three fifteen. Three fifteens, okay. But they're eighteen. Eight, eighteen is, does he have eighteen inch? Yep. Is it? Okay. And these are the eight these are the R A eight R's. These are the best. Yeah, they look like they're almost drag radials, right? Oh yeah. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, that's dope. Uh, these seven hundred. Or you get over 750, Nittles aren't gonna do it, dude. Yeah. These are the. Are these 315s? Yep. Yeah, these are 315s on the marrow. So many tires here. <laughs> so here we got the tires and the wheels here. So it's a bit dark right now, so I'm gonna resume the video tomorrow and I'm gonna show you guys. What kind of tires, what kind of wheels we have. These are for the Hellcat, by the way. So I'm going to get into, you know, more of that info tomorrow. So that's where I'll continue the video, which is in probably a few seconds for you guys. But yeah, so they're, they're here. I'm about to take them and put them right over there. So ready? Whoop. So I'm going to leave them here and then I'm going to continue the video tomorrow. Whoop. So it's the next day. I'm picking up the camera up and today... It is raining out. I'm gonna show you guys. There it is. It's raining. It's pretty sad. It's pretty sad. But that's not gonna stop us because we're not gonna go outside. We're gonna stay in the garage and we got a few things we gotta talk about. So yesterday I picked up some wheels and tires for the Hellcat. Yes, the Hellcat is gonna get uh, this set up because I'll announce it in the next video or two why this is even happening. So. Like I said, I know I've been keeping a big secret away from you guys, but just be patient. It, it, you guys are going to know everything, so just try to be patient. Shout out to my buddy Sean for the hookup. But, uh, yeah, let me show you guys uh, the wheels and the tires. So, this is what I used to have on my Hellcat. These are the Race Stars 17s wrapped around 305 Mickeys. 
there's not really much there. But these are okay, but they're not great. It's not a great setup. I wasn't a fan of the setup. It looked cool. It looked good on the car. They were small. That's all good. But it, it wasn't a good setup. The 17s aren't a good fit for my for my uh, Hellcat. I feel like 18s would do better or 15s. But I didn't want to do a 15 uh, inch conversion just yet. So there it is. Let me show you guys. So 305s, 45, 17s. So that's that's that. Here we got. New tires and new wheels. So, uh, also shout out to Mike. Rest in peace, buddy. These are his tires. I'm going to keep them. So, these tires are 305 45 18s because the wheels are 18 inch wheels. I'm going to move them over there in the light and I'm going to show you guys a little more about the wheels. The reason why these are perfect wheels is because my Hellcat wheels are satin black. Same exact color as these wheels. So these are the wheels. 18 inch uh, Bravado wheels. Let me see if it says any anywhere. Right there. Matte black or whatever. Sand black, matte black, whatever you call it. But it's the same exact color and finish as my Hellcat wheels. So it's not going to look uh, that much of a difference from the Hellcat wheels. But yeah, these are the wheels. And uh, they're going to get put on mm, in a few days. So that's one thing I'm going to get I'm gonna get done. But what do you guys think? Let me know, please. Do you guys like these? Do you guys not like them? What do you guys think? These are 18s, by the way. Let's open the second one and just to see if everything's in there because I didn't re haven't really opened it. It's wrapped up here. I gotta take this off. Well, it's tied up over here, so I just take the knot off here. And there it is. And these are. I think the center cap's right here. Oh. I just want to show you guys the center caps. Bravado Performance. Mm, I don't know. What do you guys think? Right in there. This is where it'll go. I don't know. I'm liking these. The 18s, I always thought the 18s did a lot better. So we got them. Now there's one here, one there. And these are, these are the tires for them. Right here. I want to compare these. I think they're the same exact tires. Let me put them next to each other. They are literally the same thing. Except these are 17s and they're going to be 18s on here. There it is, you see? Brand new! Let's talk about wheels and tires for your car. So let's start first talking about the Hellcat. So for the Hellcat you could go with either a 15, a 17, or an 18. It don't really matter what you want to do. It's uh, it's it's all up to you, really. I mean, if you want to hook better, you you could go with the smallest one, which is a 15. But you need a 15-inch conversion. You need to change some things around, and it'll be more costly for you. But if that's if that's the direction you want to head to, then that's what you could do. And there's a few a uh, few uh, wheel companies that you could go to. There's Race Star. There's Wells. There's um, the ones I got right now is Bravados, and I have the Race Stars. So those are those are a few good companies that you could go to. The cheapest you could get is the Bravados. Then the next up is the Race Stars. Then the Welds are the light ones, and they're really expensive. There is other wheel companies that I'm probably not remembering right now, but uh, those are the three main ones that I, I can think of at the moment. Let's talk about tires now. There's a few options you could go. You could get a Mickey Thompson, a Nitto, 
and M and H. I, I don't even know why I'm mentioning Nittles because Nittles are the worst tires to hook off a dig. Let me let me say this again: the worst drag radial to hook off a dig. Even off a roll, I mean, I have three fifteens. Um, I don't have them right now because they're at the uh, they're at my tire shop. I left them with him. I haven't went and picked them up. But I have 315 drag radio uh, Nittos, the NT555Rs or something like that. And they're the worst tires you could get. I thought I'd be able to hook. I don't hook. All I do is spin. It does look good. It looks like you have a drag radio, but it's not. It's not a good tire at all. It, I mean, it is a drag radio, but it's not a good tire at all. I mean, if, you're, if you have a stock Hellcat, I'd recommend that. But if you have... A modified Hellcat, don't get it. It's a waste of money and just, it's expensive. That that was $740 for two of them. That's a lot of money for just two tires. So, yeah, I, I'm, that was a mistake that I did with buying them. But it is what it is. It's, that's out the way. But, uh, yeah, the best I would recommend is Mickey's. That's what I have. And Mickey's do really, really well. And me personally, I don't like the 17s. I don't think they do a good of a job off a dig as the 18s do or maybe the 15s. So that's just my preference because, again, let's let's think about it this way. The Demon has 18s, not 17s. And it works for the Demon. So if it works for the Demon, I'm sure it'll work for your Hellcat. So I, I definitely go with the 18s in my opinion. I say this. If you have a stock Hellcat and you don't really dig race the car that, that much, you could put a 315 drag radio. Uh, the NT55Rs, the Nittos, and they'll do just fine. My friend Anthony did that, and he hooked and booked at the track. Literally, it was gone. So they worked really well for him. So if you have a modified Hellcat, I would not recommend you doing that. Just because you don't want to break anything. You don't want to um, wheel hop. You don't want to... If you're going to spin, then there's no point of investing $740 in those tires. And that's brand new. So you know, if you can get them used or whatever. But used drag radials is like... What's the point of getting used drag radios? You don't want them used because then they don't last as long. So, uh, that's just a few options you could go with. Me, personally, I do love the 15-inch conversion, but that's not what I'm looking for right now. I don't feel like converting my car so it can fit that. But the next best thing is an 18. I mean, there is a 17, but I don't think the 17 works as well as the 18. But that's just my personal opinion, and I've had my Hellcat for two years. I've tested it out. So with that being said, I know I don't usually have videos where I'm just sitting and talking, but we kind of, you know, got the wheels, and I wanted to tell, share that with you guys, and it's raining out. Really not much I could do right now in the rain, and like I said, just be patient. In the next few days, I will have... A huge announcement and this will be very very good for the channel and the content is about to get lit trust me just give me a few more days give me three three more days yes in three more days uh you guys are gonna you guys are gonna hear you, the video will drop and you guys are gonna go nuts on what's exactly happening so just be patient um i'm gonna tell you guys everything i know i've been leaving you guys in the dark for a little bit now but it, I'm planning all this, and it's going to make sense once I announce it. So just be patient. And, yeah, we're, uh, yeah, I can't really say much. So I, I don't want to say anything right now, but I will tell you guys when it's time. So give me, like, three more days, and I'll tell you guys everything. So I'm going to let you guys go, though. So if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, smash that subscribe button. Turn your notification bell on to stay up to date with my videos. And be part of the family, and I will see you guys next video. Love you guys. Thank you for your support. And let's hit 50,000 subscribers. We're about, what, like 6,000, 5,000 away from there. Let's hit that pretty soon so we can keep growing and we can introduce some more new things to the channel. Peace out.